there, Internet. My name's Chaotic, and welcome back to Nekopara. In last episode, we kind of learned a little bit more. Well, actually, we didn't learn a bit more. They actually got their bells, which means that they are uh, appropriate cat girls for human society, which means they can work, they can earn money from, from doing stuff, which is cool. And we also got a little bit close with Chocolate. She seems to like us a lot more, and we seem to like her a lot more, which is good. You know, we're getting a good relationship with her. We're accepting her for who she is. And Vanilla kind of walked in on that and said that we were trying to make a move, which we're clearly not. So let's see what happens. Chocolate's going to give a invoice to me. I'm right here. Uh, I'm right here. Oh, no, I wasn't right here. Okay, that was just seeing them. Ah, oh, an invoice for tomorrow's order. Okay, fair enough. Sounds good. I'll take a look at it later. Cool. Oh, what's going on? Music stopped. Music stopped. That's not good. Bye, chocolate. Love you. Oh, oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Don't stare at me. And don't say stare while you stare. What are you doing? Get away. What, what are you doing? Uh. Um. Don't, don't, don't smell me. You, you weirdo. Don't, don't, don't be smelling me. Are you inhaling me? Don't inhale me, Chocolat. What are you doing? Uh, Chocolat-san? Uh, Meow, what's up? Isn't the answer I'm looking for. What, what are you, what are you doing to me? You're creasing my shirt. <laughs> I don't know, you the one that did it. I didn't force anything. Hold up, hold up. Clearly you stuck yourself onto me, Chocolate. Yeah, exactly. Yes! Exactly that. Well, you did. Puzzled, she frantically tilted her head left and right. Is she sick with some sort of ter <laughs> some terrible disease? <laughs> this just started happening mere seconds ago, though. Are you alright? You've been kind of out of it since we got back from our break. <laughs> that doesn't make you queen, okay? <laughs> Bye. You weirdo. I don't quite know what's going on. Well, if she says she's fine, then I guess there's nothing wrong. It didn't seem like she was making any particular, mis particular mistakes while working either. I'll think about things after observing her a bit more. I thought about that as I watched her head back. That was weird. That was a really weird sequence. Are you okay? Are you, are you okay, Chocolat? You seem a bit off. Yeah, are you, are you okay? I, I'm not... Mm. Ah, oh, fair enough. I don't know what that is. Oh, I'm not here. Okay. Then it looks concerned. I... I, I don't know what... What? what. Oh, Chocolate, I was wrong. Master. About the the thing I can't pronounce, right? <laughs> You're telling me. Chocolate spaced out as she tilted her head in confusion again. It didn't seem like she was doing it on purpose. I wonder what's gone into her. It was clear that she wasn't herself. Somehow she looks a bit flushed too. <coughs> I'm just gonna feel your forehead here, okay? You got a fever? I touched her small forehead. The body shivered with a twitch. Oh no. I could feel chocolate shivering slightly through the palm of my hand. I didn't it didn't particularly seem like she had a fever or anything. Are you okay? Are you okay? You okay, chocolate? You look a little bit weird. Look a little bit weird. Huh uh chocolate? Oh again! Get off me! I know you love me and everything, but come on, get off. Get get, get off. Wait, chocolate, uh hey. I, mm, she cooed in a sweet voice I hadn't heard before. Still clinging to me, she rubbed, per, rubbed her cheeks against mine. Oh, 
Gonna, gonna, gonna. <laughs> I love that noise so much. It was clear that she wasn't feeling like herself. Her voice was especially sugary sweet. You could even say that there was a stickiness to it. What? What? <laughs> her grip on my back tightened. I could feel a certain degree of sensuality in her actions. Oh dear. Oh, oh dear. What's going on? What's, what's going on? Yeah, go do your errands, you crazy, crazy girl. She suddenly came to her senses and let go of me. She filled her arms as if she held, as she held in confusion. <laughs> I love the way she popped in. I'm... She's in love with me, isn't she? She's in love with cashew nuts. What the hell? That's kind of creepy. I thought they were already in love with me, though, but whatever. Sigh. Hey, Dinla, do you know what's with Chocola? She's acting weird today, right? Yeah, it's been pretty weird today. A breakthrough. This felt promising. I don't know how. By the way, I've been curious, but... Do I smell strange or something? You said I smelled strange earlier. Whatever. Right? It was somewhat relieving to hear that I smelled normal. Well, it meant that I didn't smell especially sweet or anything. Could it be? Oh. Oh, I, 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 that wasn't me. That's not my light. That's not my light. I'm sorry. Question mark? Vanilla was drawn in by what I had said. It seemed as if she realized something. Either way, can you tell Chocolate to go up to her room to rest? It's starting to calm down out there, so I'll take care of things afterwards. Ah! You're scaring me, girl. You, you are scaring me quite a bit. Please back off. B -b 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 back off. <laughs> Get it? Yes! <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> oh, so kawaii. This is amazing. Uh, I'm getting more into this now. It's good. It's a good game. Dot, 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 dot. Let's see. We need some more Mila Flubba, right? Surprisingly, Vanilla was the type who could rise to a challenge when necessary. I stood in front of a wide open refrigerator. And despite the distance, I could still hear the voices of my poster cat girls right behind me. Am I going to hear the voices? The voices on my head are taking over. They're telling me that my life is in danger. Crown the Empire, man. Crown the Empire. <laughs> Force clothes, changing. Okay, so we haven't had any dirty scenes in a while. So I'm hoping that doesn't happen too soon. But I'm kind of hoping it does happen at the same time. Not in a weird way, but just because I want to see what happens. Ah, oh, it's okay, you can pant. It's okay, you'll just, you've just taken a shot of adrenaline. You'll be fine eventually. I'm joking. <laughs> Don't think about Master Sen. That is not okay. You cannot just think about Master Sen. Oh, God. Oh, oh god. <gasps> no! No, no, no! Don't, no! No! I said I don't want any dirty scenes. Don't touch chocolate anywhere. <laughs> no! No! No, 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 no. Don't. Oh my god, no. Are you feeling any better, chocolate? Oh my god, what did I just walk in on? Oh, I know what I walked in on, but I don't want to accept it. They're growing up. What? That's the noise. Oh, God. Uh, uh, really? Sorry about that. Oh, God. I didn't really get why, but she was pretty mad at me. I never knocked on their doors before now, though. Besides, Chocolate would enter my room without knocking, too. Okay, well, I'll be sure to be careful next time. But more importantly, how are you feeling? I'd like to talk, take you to the clinic, but do you feel like walking up there? Yeah, the clinic. Bakery is fine. We're closed. We decided to close up early today. Do you think I could leave you be when you're not feeling well? Exactly. Exactly, Chocolat. I love you. Just listen to me and let's go up to the clinic. Do you think you can stand? What happens if I get too close? What are you talking about? You're looking about to fall over. Come on, I'll give you a hand. I stood next to Chocolat and put my arm around here. What's wrong? Did I, did I hurt you? What's 
What's going on? It's really awkward without the music. I'm kind of confused. She slurred her words as she refused my request. She was definitely acting a lot stranger than before. Enough with that now. I'm taking you to the clinic, okay? That's the whole reason why I decided to close the bakery today anyways. Come on now. Um, what's going on? Why is she talking weird? What is she doing? Rational, hold back from your instincts. Hey, you can get her a good sniff. I don't know what's going on. Then I'll push the face against Chocolate's body as she sniffed her. I knew it! What? <gasps> what? What? Came? Oh, oh my god! You told me that mating season. What? Now that she mentioned it, that was noted in the book I bought before. I thought that was a bit uh, silly for, for them, though. What do you mean, came? She didn't... No, 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 no. No, that did... No. She just means that she's in heat, right? Oh, God. Oh, oh, God. Oh, a flashback. Ah, please always be on my side from here on out. I'm so happy when you're with me. Okay, I don't care about the flashback. I've seen it before. I was there! I was there, dude. I was there. Since back then, huh? Situations when dealing with a fast maturing... I thought it said something else. I thought it said ma mass... No, I'm not saying what I thought it said, but I thought the maturing said something completely different. And I was a bit scared. I was a bit scared for my life, but okay, we're fine. I remember that section inside the book was titled that. Crap. I thought it, it was still too early to worry about stuff like that and totally glossed over it. Well, just what should I do in a situation like this? Oh my god. She looked up at me with a pain, with pain, tear-stained eyes. It was the look of a woman desperately pleading, blah, 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 pleading for help. Chocola. She completely caught me off guard, and in an instant, my face began to redden. This is bad. I could see that Chocola was not herself. My heartbeat started to slow down as it began to throb profusely. Like, oh god, I can't speak. Vanilla, help me out here. Help me out. Yes? Um, so what do I have to do? By let out, you mean... Vanilla! Vanilla was right next to my ears I looked over at her face. This didn't seem like one of her usual, usual jokes. She was looking straight at me. I'm not... I'm, I'm not... No! No, 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 no. I'm... No. Oh my god, no. Oh my god, no. Oh my god, no. Oh my god, no. Oh my, oh, oh my god, no. Don't. Don't do this to me. Please don't do this to me. Express their love for each other physically, question mark? Oh, oh my god, Cashew. You're so, you're so clueless. What un unreserved and certain words? I felt like I couldn't breathe. Vanilla paid no attention to me and continued to whisper into my ear. Oh, are they? Oh god! Oh god! Oh god, that's not good. Well, you... You, you are right, but... Of course I knew there were people like that. I just, I, I knew just how cute cat girls were, so I wasn't one to judge them. But that being said... This is, this is not happening! No! No! No, 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 Oh, God. Well, of course, she's important to me. Chocolate and vanilla were important, irreplaceable members of my family. This wasn't a matter of liking or disliking them, but that's why in the current of all this... What? Forgotten. You're not always honest. You're not always honest. Shut up, Vanilla. You're lying. Okay, flashback. I don't care. I've seen it all before. Seen it all before. The opposites attract. No, I said it all before. God damn it, you mean six. Oh. Oh god, I don't want to! Vanilla! The slender fingers caress my cheek. Don't caress anything! They were the same words as before, and they pierced right through me again, just like back then. N n no! No! No, no, no. Oh my god, I'm speechless. I... 
I don't, I don't, I don't know what to do. Chocola, just like back then, you could feel the determination behind Chocola's eyes and words. She gazed right at me. Chocolate's mm. eat. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. no. Oh, this hurts. This hurts me. This hurts me. Chocolate. I can't. Don't. Don't do anything. No. Uh, what? What just happened? What? What just happened? I returned her gaze. The chocolate took hot, shallow breath, still caught in her bewilderment. I gently placed my hand to her tear-stained cheek. I love you too, chocolate. If you really desire to, then rather than deciding whether it's right or wrong, I'll be honest too. With those words as my vow to her, I. C oh my God! He kissed the cat girl. <laughs> no! I didn't do it. I didn't do it, guys. I, I'm not a pervert. I didn't do it. I'm not into bestiality or, or incest or BC incest or whatever it is. Oh, my God, no. Oh, my God. Ah, that's right. I gently rubbed both the teary eye chocolate on the proud vanilla's heads. I then gently embraced both of them. What the hell? What? Okay. Um. I hope that's it. I hope that's it. No. 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 Okay, they're fine. They're fine. Got it, got it, got it. Yeah! I know Japanese. <laughs> I'm kidding, I don't know Japanese. Oh my god. So she's saying master, she's saying chocolate. So vanilla loves chocolate. Oh my god. Chocolate and vanilla curled up, completely appeased. Chocolate was all back to normal after being satisfied. Was that satisfied? I don't even know. Although she could have just been exhausted after all that and returned to that state soon. There's a lot of to raising cat girls, huh? To think that raising cat girls would involve this as well. I didn't think I'd become such a cat girl lover either. Well, I have no regrets. Oh god, really? With a slightly perplexed love that my god perplexed smile, I poked the cheeks of the two cat girls. <laughs> ah, that's nice. <laughs> Okay. Yes, yes, I love you too. I responded to the two cat girls as they mumbled in their sleep while rubbing their heads. They were like daughters and e No! I, I refuse! I am not being a part of this! And even lovers, no! Those feelings mixed together. If you think about it, as the owner and as a man, I guess I'm really lucky, huh? Oh my god, this got so pervy so quick. Absolutely honest goodwill with no mind games. I guess that's what made cat girls so wonderful. That's what I felt as I gazed at their innocent, sleeping faces. See you tomorrow, chocolate vanilla. I softly smoked their che stroked their cheeks once more. They responded to my caresses while sleeping. I tidied up chocolate vanilla's bed. I gazed upon the precious sleeping faces one last time and quietly left their room. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Okay, can I pause? Can I pause? Is that a thing I can do? Is that a thing I can do? Can I pause? Pause, pause, where's pause? That's pause, okay. Shut up, chocolate! Okay. Well, I hope you guys somewhat enjoyed this episode or at least a bit intrigued by it i oh my god i can't even i can't even come to uh, come to understand what just happened um i think in the uncensored version some more stuff happened than, than just the kissing but i i don't want to get into that i don't want to understand what happened i i don't want to know i don't want to know um just i'll see you guys in the next episode goodbye <laughs>